guys, welcome to the Massive Iron Channel. I'm Steve Shaw, Editorial Director at TigerFitness.com and Muscle & Brawn Nutrition CEO. Big story from within the industry. Bodybuilding.com is suing GNC, and I have the story right here in front of me, for $100 million in damages. Um, basically, GNC is selling Jim, the Jim line from Jim Stepani. And bodybuilding.com is claiming um, ownership of it. And it appears to me um, as, you know, someone who is an outsider of this at bodybuilding.com obviously manufactures this, has the rights to this. And there's some kind of rocky relationship between Jim and bodybuilding.com. And now GNC is selling the gym line of supplements and they're being sued for it. I have a link which I'm going to post below from Priceplow. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm going to read a little bit of the information. Um, today, while checking Pacer, we saw that there is a motion to correct amend the Jim Stepani lawsuit. Had the two, two sides reached a settlement, um, Priceplow says not even close. Instead, Bodybuilding.com amended the lawsuit to include GNC and they are seeking $100 million in damages. Um, you can actually go on there and read the entire lawsuit. There's a link on there. And again, the link um, to this article at Price Plow is below. This is not a joke or a drill. The two behemoths are about to clash. Get it on time, boys and girls. Get it on. The lawsuit bullet points from Price Plow. Uh, Bodybuilding.com is seeking $100,000 in damages. Uh, Bodybuilding.com is seeking cancellation of trademark number 4561658, Gym Supplement Science. Bodybuilding.com has named Does 1 to 100. There are John Does to be named in the future. And we assume they are reserved for any individual franchises or stores who dare sell any gym products. Uh, the complaint includes comparisons of the new Gym 2.0 labels as evidence that Bodybuilding.com's Gym uh, trademark has been violated. And Bodybuilding.com's lawyers caught Jim Stepani using his website to state that his products won the Bodybuilding.com Award of Excellence, but now show the new Gym, GNC Gym 2 pictures, new products that never won any such awards, a major conflict of interest. So basically, Jim showing, showing Jim 2.0 and referencing a Bodybuilding.com award. Uh, Bodybuilding.com doesn't like this because that's not the product that won the award. Basically, he got caught only half updating his site. Um, another bullet point, Bodybuilding.com claims to have sent warnings to both GNC and Jim about this, presumably during the summer, and those warnings went unheeded. Uh, due to the third point, which is... Um, the third point is the John Doe's that are left blank in the lawsuit. Due to the third point, we strongly recommend anyone considering selling gym supplements or making pre-gym knockoff to seriously reconsider. Hashtag no shit. Uh, Bodybuilding.com is clearly not in a joking mood today. Uh, and then Price Plow goes on to say, will this settle? In a video posted on September 21st, Mike stated that he believes this will settle, blah, 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 blah. I believe it'll settle too. Look, um, these are big boys. They're not going to waste years and years in the court or whatever the heck this lawsuit's going to take months and months. They're going to settle, in my opinion. So look for an update on that reasonably soon. As soon as the lawyers get together with a lot of coffee in a big room and come to an agreement. So again, bodybuilding.com is suing GNC for $100 million. They've left it open-ended. Uh, anybody suing the gym line of products is going to get sued as well. So the big boys, the big boys are after each other's throat. So guys, hope this video has been of some help. If you have any questions or comments, check out the link below. You can submit your questions directly to me. If you made it this far in this video and have yet to subscribe to my channel, please do. I'd appreciate the support. So guys, as always, thanks for watching. Have a great day.